Hi guys, I hope you're all really well. My name's Lucy and in today's video I'm going to be doing an Invisalign update. I've had Invisalign for quite a few weeks now. I'm actually moving up to tray 8 today. So in this video I thought I would show you me changing into tray 8. It's a little bit risky for me to do it on camera because sometimes the trays have been an absolute dream and have just got in, gone in so nicely and I can take them in and out really nicely and I'm not in too much pain. Sometimes they're really really hard to actually even clip in and they really really hurt and I can't really talk after so yeah this is a bit of a risk. I haven't even opened them so I don't know how they're going to fit. I'm hoping they're quite tight because I feel like the ones that I've got in at the moment aren't particularly tight so yeah I kind of like that tight feeling because I know that my teeth are moving but obviously I don't want to be in too much pain. So if you haven't watched any of my other Invisalign videos before I've only made a couple I made one last on the kit that I take around with me so I'll pop a link to that below and I also did an update after one week of having my braces so I'll pop the link for that one below as well just so you can catch up with where I'm at and why I had braces. So the way I feel about them at the moment is great, so I'm literally loving them. I feel like the last couple of trays haven't hurt in the slightest which I don't know if is, I don't know if that's a good thing or not, like I said I quite like them to feel quite tight because I know my teeth are moving but at the same time I definitely think my teeth have moved with every single tray. I've noticed so much difference already, so many people have said to me you're smiling a lot more and your smile seems more confident and it's changed so much so I feel really really chuffed with that seeing as I'm only coming up to tray 8 and I've got another 30 to go. I'm really really excited for the end results because I feel like my teeth already have changed so much and I already feel so much more confident about my smile. So there has been some downsides to having Invisalign. I've actually had attachments put onto my teeth so you can really really see this one here and I've got a few on this tooth, I've got some back here and then I've got a few on the bottom as well. So when I first had the attachments, I hated them. I literally wanted to cry because when when the brace is on, it's fine. They're just kind of like, they're bumpy, but they're smooth. But when the brace is off, they're really, really, really rough. They feel like you've got cement in your mouth or somebody explained it really well to me. They said it feels like they've got stones stuck to their teeth and that's exactly what it feels like. Um, it took me a few days to get used to it because when you eat, obviously, I'm always conscious of having food in my teeth anyway, but when you've got these attachments, food gets like stuck like around them, I'm sort of sat there like picking it all out, but whatever. <laughs> I don't think that there's as much food there as it feels there because obviously the attachments are there, so I think it's actually the attachments to me feel dirty, if that makes any sense. If you've got Invisalign and you've got attachments, you'll know what I mean. It's really funny with Invisalign because I feel like people seem to get a different treatment and a different process wherever they go. So two of my best friends are actually going through the Invisalign process and one is going with the same dentist as me so she has the exact same experience so she's having attachments and she's changing her braces weekly. My other friend has got no attachments and has had no mention of them, she hasn't had to have any teeth filed or anything but she's on two week changes so obviously she's changing her braces less. Um, I don't really know what's best but my dentist said that Invisalign recently moved up to one week changes or even sooner in some cases because they realise that your teeth actually move the most in the first 24 to 48 hours and then any time after that they're just sort of sitting in that new position. So it kind of makes sense that you change them every week and I have found that after seven days my brace is totally like really easy to get in and out. So I feel like I'm ready to change after the week. So I guess weekly changes is better. It's definitely better for me because it means my process and my treatment's going to be done a lot sooner than it would be if I was changing them every two weeks. But I guess it just depends which dentist you go to. I think maybe if you have been told to change them every two weeks, you could ask to see if you can change them sooner. Um, but yeah, I, I wouldn't worry too much. I guess like everybody's teeth are different and all dentists are different as well. So I did just briefly mention about teeth filing and that is something that I did have to have done and I do have to have a little bit more done in I think like three or four weeks time, which I'm really freaking out about. So I must admit, I absolutely hated it. It really, really hurt. So I had to have uh, gaps made in between all of my teeth. So that wasn't too bad. That was just like... A little, it was a bit like dental floss but it was metal and he just pulled it through each tooth and that just felt really weird but it didn't really hurt because it wasn't taking away that much tooth but on the bottom I had to have an electric file and it, it like 
filed about a millimeter between each of these teeth at the bottom oh my freaking god it hurts so so much i was in so much pain i was crying i had tears like streaming down my face um but obviously it was fine afterwards it didn't hurt at all afterwards they just felt a bit sensitive but at the time it was really really painful like i'm not gonna lie it was really really painful and i also felt like my front teeth after that felt quite wobbly i don't know if that's in my head but i still feel like they're a little bit wobbly now like i don't want to bite anything on my front two teeth at the bottom because they literally just feel like they're just going to wobble out which i'm pretty sure they're not going to but they do feel a little bit like that so i'm going to mention that next time i go to the dentist which is in two or three weeks I think yeah it's in like two or three weeks so I'm going to mention it to him when I go there that they do feel a bit wobbly if you've got Invisalign then do let me know if your teeth have felt wobbly because I do feel like mine are quite wobbly which is a little bit scary because I really don't want them to fall out what else what else what else so again with the attachments they do make it a lot harder to get my braces in and out I've actually just purchased a little tool called an Alti on Amazon which should be turning up any day now to help me get my braces on and off because it's just so hard i actually have to take them off from the inside which you'll see in a minute actually because i'm gonna change my trays I can't just like when before i had the attachments put on i could just like pull them from here but because the attachments are there it makes them really hard to get off which is kind of annoying but they are there for a reason and i have i have found that since i've had the attachments my teeth have moved quicker and i feel like it's helping to pull them into position a little bit easier but let's get on with it and change to tray number eight so i've got a box here and this is what my dentist gave me last time i went because i wasn't going to be seeing him for a couple of months so he gave me a box with like a bunch of trays in there which is really exciting and they very kindly put dates on there for me so today's the 24th so I'm going to be changing into that one. So each tray comes in a little bag like this and it's completely sealed. If you're ever worried about them being non-hygienic or you think somebody's tampered with your bag, then do let your dentist know because obviously you want it to be as clean as possible. Um, but yeah, this is sealed, so I'm just going to go and open that. I always find that when I first put a new set in, they smell and taste like spring onion and that's really weird and quite a lot of people say they put them in and they taste like a bit clinical i've heard other people say that they taste really sweet but i really think mine tastes like spring onion which just makes me feel really sick so quite often i will wash them before i wear them so i'll scrub them with like toothpaste before i put them in my mouth to make them taste a bit easier here are my new trays there's the top and the bottom they don't look that much different to the ones i've put in other than the fact that they are super super clean so like i said it's quite hard to get these off but i'm going to show you how i've been getting them off with the attachments on like the easiest and pain most painless way So that's the top sorry if there's any spit there so i'm just going to compare the two so this is my old invisalign and this is the new so as you can see these are quite grubby now and are ready for the bin and my new ones are nice and clean and the bottom is actually even harder to get out ah yeah i'm sure you could hear that click that is how hard they are to get in and out and again that's the bottom so quite cloudy and gross and then these are the new ones which are nice and clear and clean so i normally find that my top teeth hurt less than my bottom teeth do so i normally start by putting the top tray in and then the bottom i just wanted to show you my teeth without the braces on so you can see the attachments a little bit better so these are my teeth at the moment as you can see they are still quite wonky i've still got a way to go but this attachment here is my least favorite because <laughs> it's really like sticky outy it's really rough and i just feel like i can always see it in pictures i feel like you can really see the attachments that well apart from that one that one really does annoy me my lip sometimes gets caught on it as well when i'm smiling it, i'm like i'm like this and then my lip like gets caught up here and it just looks really really rubbish so let's put in the top tray i'm a little bit nervous like i said i never know how this is gonna feel so my dentist told me to always put in the front teeth first so push the front teeth up first and then push in the back so that's what i'm gonna do ah okay it feels tight i 
I like to just like push really hard for like a few seconds. Wow, this is quite tight. This is a lot tighter than my last set. Yeah, so it feels really, really tight this side and not so much this side, but yeah, I'm guessing these ones are gonna be moving quite a lot. That is my knee tray. I always think that as soon as I put my new tray in, my teeth already look a little bit better and a little bit straighter. And I always find that my teeth look really shiny when I'm wearing my braces. So I really like wearing them. Like they're not like a hardship to wear. Okay, let's put it in the bottom. So again, I'm gonna start with pushing it on the front teeth and then push it down on the back teeth. Oh, oh that wasn't too bad. Again, I like to like push down for a few seconds quite hard. Okay, the bottom actually feels fine. Quite tight, but fine. I'm getting that spring onion taste, which is <laughs> so, so weird. Okay, the bottom actually feels okay. The top feels really, really tight. I always find that when I put in a new tray, my lisp gets a little bit worse for like the first day as it's getting used to it, I don't know why. I'm slowly getting used to obviously having Invisalign and having to brush my teeth like 15 times a day. I am still being really, really strict, so I'm definitely brushing my teeth after every snack, after every meal, cup of tea, any drink that isn't clear. I'm still brushing my teeth and making sure that I'm keeping my braces really clean. So that's it from me. I hope that you've enjoyed this video and you have seen a little update of my Invisalign process. I don't think, feel like I have that much to update yet. Obviously, I'm still very early in my treatment. I'm not even halfway yet, but I am really impressed with the results so far. Thank you for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye.